tires are cold, I'm trying to warm them up a little bit because it's 55 or 60 degrees out before I take off. So I didn't win the Powerball again. The big jackpot went up to, started up just under a billion and then it got to 1.5 billion dollars. No such luck. I bought uh, a couple tickets. Like everybody else in the world seemed to do that day. I've never seen line so long to buy lottery tickets. It was amazing. I guess people were driving um, out of state in the states that they don't have lottery even to go play the lottery. But I guess three people won the jackpot. They're going to split it. I think it was somebody in California, somebody in Tennessee, and somebody in Florida. Not me in Florida, somebody in Melbourne, Florida. But the odds of winning that Powerball were minuscule, one in a couple hundred million or something. But for everybody that didn't win, don't feel bad. Millions of other people didn't win. And you could have been like the 67 year old guy in Fort Worth, Texas with even worse luck. On Monday he went out for a walk to go get a Powerball ticket in Fort, I think it was Fort Worth, 67, and he never came home, and after dark they called the police looking for this 67 year old guy. Apparently, he's got even worse luck than you or me. On the way to the store to buy his Powerball ticket, he passed a construction site and fell in a seven foot hole, fell to the bottom of it, and wasn't found until after dark when the police were called and asked to go out and search for him. flashing lights are for up here. Maybe they're doing some road work or something. Yeah. So just before I turn on my GoPro, of course, there were a couple Alachua County Sheriffs riding down the road with me. Should be a 
warmed up by now. So I'll find out somewhere to pull around up here. A couple hours from now, there's a real good concert in town. Um, Reverend Horton Heat, Unknown Henson, Nashville Pussy, and Igor and the Red Elvises, four different bands, are playing at the Woolly, downtown Gainesville. There's where the speed starts dropping big time, 55, 45, then it gets to 35 up there. So, time to turn around.
was a good little run. Now I can pull off and uh, start the camera up again. Try to keep the videos from being too long. It's a real headache to try to edit them. The GoPro just haphazardly breaks up the videos at different spots wherever it wants. So if the video is really long, back where I started from. So if the video is very long, it's a, it's a lot of editing to figure out. Alright guys, catch you later.